Hey guys, today we are making catfish pepper soup. If you're interested, please relax and continue watching. I'm going to start by defrosting my catfish. I usually buy in bulk and I store in the freezer. So here I just soaked the fishes in room temperature water and I left it there to defrost. Then for us to wash the catfish, we need boiling water. Okay, that's the easiest way to wash catfish and to remove all the slimes from catfish. I have made a video on that, you may check it out if you are interested. Once you pour the boiling hot water, you notice that the slimes will cuddle. Next, transfer to your cooking pot once you are done washing the catfish and add all your ingredients. Here I added ground crayfish, ground ehuru and ground oziza. I also added some no seasoning powder. I added salt to taste. I added a mixture of onion, um, habanero pepper, and one fresh tomato. Lastly, I poured in um, boiling water. Okay, it is very important to start off um, cooking your catfish with boiling water. The boiling water will help um, stiffen and toughen up the fish, thereby preventing them from disintegrating inside the pot. Another thing that you should do to avoid disintegration is just to shake your pot. You don't have to use your spoon to stir. Just shake the pot and move them around. That's the easiest way to prevent the catfish from disintegrating. Then cook for about 20 minutes. Those catfish pepper soup can be paired with unripe plantains, with yams, um, with rice, or with any carbohydrate of your choice, okay? On this day, I paired it with um, plantains. I just boiled it for a few minutes, and I prefer boiling my plantains with the skin. I just feel like it adds more nutrients to the plantains. I don't know if I'm the only one that does that. Please let me know in the comment section. If you boil your plantains with the skin as well just boil for 15 minutes and serve with the pepper soup okay just serve it hot this is best enjoyed during winter or hamatan i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you did please leave a comment in the comment section and please click on the like button you can also share to your family and friends and I'll see you guys in my next one. Until then, stay safe and God bless you.